All right, we're here with Doc Positive and Violet from Dog Star Energy Center. And Violet heard the story of our little wiener dog friend here, Parker, with no anal tone, no bladder control, injury to his tail. And so she is actually here just starting some uh, canine therapeutic massage on Parker. I don't know if you guys were watching him earlier. He was like a lunatic. He was running around. These dogs immediately pick up. Uh, I used to think this was a lot of hocus pocus, but they, they pick up on Violet's energy. He's laying there. He's letting her, uh, you know, start some massage, some basic... Uh, Techniques on him. This is all. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. <laughs> He's adorable. But Violet has been doing this for longer than she cares to admit. <laughs> but she stepped right up and volunteered to help us out with this little guy because. He's probably eight, nine, ten weeks old, and if we can give him some um, bowel control, bladder control, and so forth. He definitely has a chance for a long life ahead of him. If he doesn't have bowel control or bladder control, hey, he'll be just like every other dachshund then. So <laughs> that's not really a fair comment, but dachshunds are not known for their uh, potty trainability. So, all right, more to follow. And you can't hear the sound effects here. He he's like, oh, he's he's loving this, and uh, he's just taking it all in. And we'll see. In case you're wondering here, this is our, our conference table in our business center. We have a sick puppy in the hospital. We didn't want to expose Parker here to the sick puppy who's got a pretty nasty upper respiratory infection. And so we're doing his uh, therapy here on the uh, conference table, lunch table. Violet has helped us out so many times with her therapeutic massage, not only with our own animals, Whitney and Climber and Peak, you know, with their training, some of their uh, recuperative therapeutic massage. Also Whitney, when she was hit by the car and had to have hip surgery, uh, when she tore her flexor tendon, you know, so uh, we depend on Violet a lot for her. Remember, that's dogstarenergycenter.com. Check it out. She's also on Facebook. Bye. All right. He started out real good holding still. <laughs> now Doc Positive has to create a diversion up front here. So, hey. I love Frank. Yes. So, we're doing what we can to help. But if he keeps biting me on the lip, I'm going to bite him back on the nose. So we'll see. Violet's got that end. I got this end. And we'll work our way to the middle of this prank. <laughs> like I said, I'm eating away at this end while Violet's doing all the work. So you can see, as usual, Doc Positive's having all the fun. And other people are doing all the work. So we're making sure Violet gets credit for doing the work while I just typically... People wonder, you know, why do I have yappy hour? I love puppies. Yes. So I, I make my living just playing with other people's dogs. Yes. You keep biting me, I'm going to bite you back. It is the evil peak meister. Peak. That's why we call him Peak. Not really, but he's like peeking over here. Like, uh, 
Yes. He says, can I be massaged next, Miss Violet? <laughs> you know I love massage. I'll even hold still. <laughs> Very cool. You do have puppy breath. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, you do. Yeah. Very good. That's very good. So, Violet has the patience of a saint here <laughs> to, uh, oh, very good. Look to at work that. with a little guy like Parker here. Uh, he's not so bad. At least they don't have to get up and chase him. <laughs> So we will definitely keep everybody posted on Parker's progress.